Good morning, good morning from Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. I'm Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group with your morning market stir for Friday, June 26th. Markets slid at the close yesterday as no news out of Greece. We see the markets down five and a half points in the E-mini S&P at 2094 was the close after being unchanged much of the session. Dow futures took the brunt down 71, 17,812 as we see the cash Dow staying below that 18,000 pivot. And the Nasdaq down seven at 4509. Currencies were very quiet, 95.38 in the dollar index, down three ticks. The euro had a high at 112.39 and a low at 111.65, so another consolidation day. Ended up finishing down four, but still above the 112 level at 112.14. Bonds back down some more, 149.18, down nine. Crude oil still going nowhere, down 60 cents at 59.70. Just pivots around that $60 level. Yesterday's high, 60.45. Yesterday's low, 59.45, a dollar range for the whole session. And gold also muted, 1177 high, 1170 low, down $1 at 1172 as the markets are very much on hold until we get a resolution. So looking at the action here this morning, right now we're up five points in the E-mini S&P, getting back our loss from yesterday at 2099. The all-time high stands at 2126, not that far away, but it's been a long time, May 19th, that high peak was put in in that broad market S&P. Dow futures up 47, 17,849, and then NASDAQ up six at 45.15 and one half after making new all-time highs just Wednesday. The dollar's up three, the euro's down three. Not much happening there. Bonds continue to slide down another 20 ticks at 148.30, spiking up the yields. The yields on the 30-year, 3.19%, and looking at the 10-year, 2.42%, closing in on 2.5%, something we haven't seen in a long, long time. Looking at crude, up 20 cents at 59.50 right now. Sorry, down 20 cents at 59.50. Where will we finish, above or below 60? That's the big question on a weekly basis. And gold going nowhere either, up $1.1173 with big losses on a weekly basis. So to wrap up this current action with two hours ago before the cash stock market opened, we're getting back the losses from yesterday in the stock indexes, up five in the S&P, up 47 in the Dow, and up six in the NASDAQ futures. I will see you early Monday morning for your morning market stir to set up your trading day. Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group, where it all comes back to commodities.